This is why I like the new Ninjago Dragon's Rising suits so, so much. Something that's very incredible about these suits is they add an extra layer onto them. This type of layer is like dragon scales or dragon-esque elements. One of my favorite franchises besides Ninjago is How to Train Your Dragon, and something that I really loved about the third film was what they did to their armor in that they used their dragon scales, um, but they got off the dragons for extra armor so they could walk through flames and other sort of stuff while on their dragons so they didn't get hurt. An interesting way Ninjago could definitely go upon this is using scales and having them in their colors. And we've actually seen this before in Crystallized where Pixel actually gives a great reasoning on the golden armor being on their ninja suits using it to sort of be like not a defect a defect against the crystal um, creatures that they can just bounce through them i really think that would be such a great idea and something that ninjago dragons rising could do because i know a lot of fans are very always confused on why do ninja have different suits and only a couple of suits are actually explained properly and if ninjago is going to keep going over the couple of years that they have since 2019 explaining how they gain these suits ninjago dragons rising season two could exactly do this with just saying they added extra dragon scales please let me know your thoughts about this new idea uh, i really like like the ninja suits we've only seen obviously jay cole um no sorry zane cole and lloyds but i'm still impressed with the suits and all well designs please let me know your thoughts and tell me in the comments so i know you watched the end do you think uh nia will get um maroon in her color or light blue because Zane is using the light blue let me know your thoughts peace out guys